Hi, we are here at the Korean and USA Startup Summit 2022 and the Pier 17 in New York. And thanks to the global partnership between Le Café de Geek, French high tech media, myself, and Evening News, we're doing some interviews here. Next interview is with IESG, a startup present here on the Never Cloud booth. Hi. Hi, Leo. Hi, nice to meet you. Nice, nice uh, meeting. Nice. My name is Belkin, CEO at IESG. Uh, nice to meet you, Belkin. Can you introduce us, uh, IESG, the company? Yes, like, you know, uh, we are glad to explain it. IESG is basically uh, a B2B SaaS solution for uh, the small and medium enterprises. Mm -hmm. So uh, we are focusing on the ESG market. Yes. Have you heard about the ESG? Not yet. <laughs> ESG is basically a short form of environment, mm -hmm. social, and governance. Okay. So it's like a three different pillars. Mm -hmm. And the ESG market is rapidly growing regulated sector, and many companies are not effectively dealing with the requirements. That's why we yes. prepared the solution for companies. Okay. What yeah. kind of companies uh, can need your help on this uh, regulation? Uh, actually, uh, you know, like uh, there's uh, like you know, many regulations in different reasons. Like a European market, there's yes. a regulation, ESG related regulation, U US too, and all over the world. And then according to the regulation, actually, all of the companies need to respond to the regulations. Okay. Directly, indirectly. Okay. So, uh, because this is a huge need of uh, your solution. Uh, maybe you can um, explain us how is it working, how the company can use uh, your solution. Yes, basically, uh, if you, uh, your company, uh, get the request from your like you know, stakeholders to respond to ESD related yes, issues, and then the problem is you don't clearly understand what the ESD is, yeah. and then you don't know what kind of things we need to do. Exactly. Then we can solve that issue. Okay. We are big data driven, like an unbiased solution. That's mm -hmm. why we accumulate all the ESG related data. So uh, then this is like a, a software yeah, solution. So if you don't have a, like, you know, knowledges and knowledge and backgrounds, you can simply enter into our com uh, solution that you can use our solution without just the previous like knowledges and uh, the experiences. Okay. And then we cover basically a self assessment and a reporting. And uh, we can also like provide an IESG dashboard. And then at the, at the ISD dashboard, you can check everything you need from company ESD history and big data analysis and uh, customized ESD related intelligence too. Okay. So, so it's basically information that's very service. complete. Yeah. So let's imagine I'm a French company <laughs> and my stakeholder are asking me to follow this regulation. I can just uh, register on your website and you will be helping me by doing all of that? Yes, yes. We, <clears throat> we accumulate the data set and then if you can just log in our software, you can just click why yeah. you need a response. Okay. And then what kind of industry you are in mm -hmm. and then what kind of like a purpose you need to do. Then based on this one, we have a, like an algorithm, like a recommendation algorithm. We can, based on your like answer, we can provide you like you know optimal solution for your needs. That's and really you can just try to yeah. follow our guidelines. You can just fill up, and then you can just respond to your stakeholders. And then at the same time, you yeah. can also manage your all yes to related histories. That's very good. Yeah. And uh, what would be the cost for me of doing that? You mean the cost? Yeah, the cost. That's a good question. That's a good question. Yeah. So like we target SMEs, like yeah. small, medium enterprises, and we conducted already like a series of interviews, and we found out that uh, the, like a reasonable range of the pricing. So we have now three different pricing uh, ranges. Okay. And the first thing, uh, like initial essential model, would be started at around uh, $10,000 per uh, year. Okay, yeah. $10,000 per year. Yeah. But, yeah. Without this kind of solution, you need to actually hire a consulting company yeah, yeah. that you need to pay more than... Yeah. And if your stakeholder are asking you to do that... Yeah. And if your stakeholder are asking you to do regulation, it's been your market is big enough for being in need of regulation mm. and following them. So you might have the budget for that. So okay, that's very good. Oh, um, and is your solution available for uh, companies in any country of the world? Not yet. Not so, yet. like, you know, we actually uh, prepared this solution and then we intentionally target Korean market first. Of course. So that we need to understand the market dynamics. As I, uh, actually, Korea is 
export dominant industry. Yes. And then there are many, many companies to expose us to the European regulation, regulation, US regulation, other things. And one of the advantage, key advantage is we started as a corporate venture of Fortune 500 company. Mm -hmm. So we have a better accessibility to like in you know, company customers. That's true. So once we have a clear understanding of the market and customer, that we can expand to global. But we hopefully uh, expand our global version within a year. Okay, that's that's very good. But it's already very good for Korean companies because I know company in Korea have a lot of issues exporting to Europe, especially. Right. There's so many C regulations. There are many many yeah. companies who are not effective with dealing with the requirements. And uh, one last question is about the show. Uh, what? Why are you here? What are you expecting from the show in New York currently? Yeah, that's a good. Good. Uh, so as we already prepared our global service, although we started from the Korean market first. Yes. Basically, uh, our version is software is like a global version. Okay. So uh, the reason we are here is because we just want to communicate with uh, stakeholders, including investors, okay. and also potential customers, to test the market and then uh, the compatibility of our service in a global mm. stage. That is the main reason why we are here. That makes sense. That makes a lot of sense. Maybe also American company try to export in Europe exactly. and have issues. Or maybe export to Korea or so. Yes. And have issues. So okay. it's all connected. Yeah, it's all connected. That's very good. Okay, thank you very much for your time. Thank you thank for you being for the here. Interview. And hope to see you again and hope your company is doing good in the future. Thank you, Leo. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.